Hi everybody, my name's Josh. And I'm Sarah. And together, we make up Harder Reviews. So we decided to make a YouTube channel and review everything. And we wanted to start with the As Seen On TV products. So today, we are gonna review the Gotham Steel. No stick pan made with titanium and ceramic. So the As Seen On TV ad claims that nothing will stick to this. You don't have to butter or grease it. Um, what else can we do with it? Well, we can also put it in the oven. Oh. Up to 500 degrees Fahrenheit. We're not gonna do it that hot today, but 400 degrees. Okay. Well, uh, so what kind of things? I know we're planning to do some eggs. Yeah, some scrambled eggs, which we will scramble in the pan because Ooh. it won't scratch either. Um, I'm gonna make this sauce that I like to put on top of my ice cream. It's like uh, chocolate chips and marshmallows and peanut butter, so that's pretty sticky. So we're gonna we're gonna really see if this this is non-stick. All right, so we have our pan. We have our stove. Mm -hmm. And our two farm fresh eggs. And From the chickens right in the yard. Yes. And we have turned the stove top onto medium high heat. in here quite vigorously because I want to see if it won't scratch. Well, it looks like it's working good. Yeah. Can I see? Yeah, sure. Oh, it looks, looks like meat. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Well, we'll see if that scratched it, because that sounded pretty bad. Wow. This actually looks pretty good. <laughs> we just left those eggs on there. I'm actually really impressed. Let's turn it up a little bit. So, so far it looks like it's working just the way the ad says. Mm -hmm. So, the ad does say that it will slide right off. Yeah, it was a little crusted on there, but I don't know, it's still looking pretty good. Oh, I got some egg on the stove. <sighs> I'm sure that happens to all of us. <laughs> You want to burn the eggs, right? That's what's going on here. <laughs> I'm gonna see what it takes to 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 make eggs stick to this pan. If we can get one side of the if if we can make it smoke, that's all we want. <laughs> okay, so these these are burnt, and it just kind of it flipped off there. So I think eggs confirmed. All right. <laughs> so next we're gonna do my ice cream topping. Uh, it involves chocolate chips, however many you want, um, some marshmallows and some peanut butter. So the pan's good and hot, so we're just gonna throw our chocolate chips right in, right in there. And those are gonna get melting and that's gonna be really smelly. We should probably turn this down a little bit. <laughs> and... Uh, we'll just throw one more handful in there. Uh, and peanut butter. Oh. So, normally I do this in the microwave, but given the fact that we wanted to see if we can make something stick to this, we decided to do it in the pan. And as you can see, it's smoking quite heavily. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't even put the marshmallows in there yet, so. This is gonna be interesting. Oh, I see some stuff sticking to the bottom a little bit, but. 
<laughs> wow. That's pretty impressive. So, I mean, it takes a little bit of scraping, but... Oh, I also see some scratches at the bottom of the pan. Are there some scratches? There is. Oh. Hmm. Maybe my fork scratching did a little bit of damage. I think so. Well, I guess you just can't use forks with something like this. I'm definitely not going to be putting this on my ice cream. It looks like there's some, some black in there. Let's throw some marshmallows in. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is definitely, it smells really bad. Uh, when YouTube has smell vision we'll get you that video. Our cameraman's coughing right now. <laughs> It, so much. it smells real bad, <laughs> but the main test of this is to see if anything's sticking. It's not okay. to taste well, things. Let's just let it sit for a little bit and see what happens. Okay, so this has been sitting on here for like a solid minute mm -hmm. without anything touching it. So let's just see if anything's. Wow. Okay. Oh. No, it's. I mean, it takes a little bit of scraping, but it pretty much comes right off. So, I mean, it's not as perfect as you see in the add-on TV, which we'll have a link for uh, below our video. I'm actually, I'm pretty impressed. I think we're gonna keep using this pan after we're done with this. So, even if we don't make it big on YouTube, we still have a cool pan. <laughs> Cooler than Silver lining, everybody. Okay, so as you can see, there's uh, a little bit of stuff stuck to it. Uh, you tried cleaning it a little bit, didn't you? Yeah, I tried to scrape it a little bit, and that's, well, as you can see. Yeah, um, we'll definitely work on this a little bit more. We still have a pie to make. Um, I don't know if you can see, but right here we have a couple scratches from the fork. So you can scratch this, but I was being a little bit aggressive. <laughs> I think we'll still use it, though. Um, but yeah, we have a couple dishes here that we prepared. Would you like to I'm taste some good. eggs? Okay. I guess I'm the only one doing taste test. So here's some nice eggs. They're kind of black. I like burnt food, so this is, I mean, that's a win for me. And next is my ice cream topping. It kind of looks like... <laughs> it looks like dirt. <laughs> <laughs> so next time you're having a party for your kids and you want them to, you know, pretend that they're eating dirt on their ice cream, just do this. <laughs> it's still really hot, so maybe, maybe let it cool down. If I had it on ice cream, it'd probably be better. But, yeah. Bon appetit! Oh! <laughs> you idiot! <laughs> well, it looks like our uh, pie came out looking pretty good. I cut through and it seems like it hasn't stuck. We're gonna have to let, let the pie cool before we can really test it, but looks delicious and smells delicious. So, we're going to say that this is a made by, I think? Yeah, um, well, if you are nicer to it than I was, <laughs> you could probably get away with buying this and actually using it, but I did put some scratches in and the uh, chocolate marshmallow peanut butter mixture kind of burnt a nice, <laughs> Uh, a little a little crisp on the top of the pan, so. Yeah. Um, it's pretty much exactly the same as any other non-stick pan. So. So, it's up to you guys. Uh, I'd look for a sale maybe at Winners or a discount store. Um, it's not worth 40 bucks. No, it's definitely not worth the, the, the $39.99 that we paid. <laughs> um... And yeah, so 
if you want to like, comment, and subscribe. We we totally appreciate we'll it. Keep making these videos. Uh, and if you have any products that you want to see, just leave it in the comment. And yeah. Thanks a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Ah! Ah!